Carla Welch is a full-time mom, but is also a farmer's market vendor. You could say she is locally famous for her salsa that she sells every Saturday. I enjoy that people know when it was, it was made so they know that it was a fresh made product, that it was made two days ago. Like, that's cool for me. Carla and her husband were inspired to create salsa by their passion for food. They've lived in big cities before and have seen the impact of farmer's markets, so they decided to sell their salsa here in Williston. Okay, this is very rewarding because you get to share culture and you get to share what you love and what you do and just everything that you, you pretty much know how to make at home and I just share it with everybody and people love it at the farmer's market. Carla makes her family first priority, but this is a hobby she shares with everyone. With salsa making, she turned this into a family affair. Her husband makes his own special flavor, and she even makes the labels for the jars. Her son Asher is sometimes her little helper as well. So it, it doesn't take away from my time with my family. It just gives me something on my own to do, but also, you know, be around them. Hello. Ding, 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 ding. The farmer's market is a perfect outlet for talents and artists to show off their work. The market was moved this year to the Hedericks lot directly on Main Street, where they renamed the Williston Farmers Market to Main Street Market. The Williston Downtowners Association really changed it into a place where families and people want to stick around and hang out. Executive Director of the Williston Downtowners Association, Luis Scari, says, with the market they are able to support small businesses and build community. People not only got to connect with other people in their community, but they got, they got to connect with the vendors that were coming out. And my favorite thing about the farmer's market is it showcases the different people in the community. The Downtowners Association is hoping to see more vendors for next year. In Williston, I'm Jennifer Henry, NBC North Dakota News.